Hi guys, Jennifer here from Beauty is Virtue, and I wanted to bring to you today a beautiful vintage hanger. And I basically used, uh, you know, the ones that you get in a four or five pack, the, the um, light wood hangers from the store. I think I got these at Tuesday morning and they come in a pack for like four or five dollars and I altered it with some beautiful laces, some beautiful bridal trim and some bling and um, as well as some vintage lace. So this is what the overall hanger looks like and I'll explain to you a little bit what I did. Well, basically, I painted the entire hanger a very light cream color and it made the hanger part, you know, look very shabby. So, and just from working with it, the paint, you know, kind of came off a little bit. So I sealed that with some, um, like Mod Podge medium, some, some glue finish so that it will be, you know, sturdy enough and it won't, the paint won't completely come off. And I put several coats of that, like varnish finish. And then I, I have this beautiful lace that I adore and I need to get some more of it, but I covered the entire hanger with this beautiful vintage lace, which I had shown in a previous video in my teapot video. Excuse me. This is, this is the beautiful lace. And as you can see, I'm needing to replenish my stock. So anyway, I got that from D. Armstead store, Elegant Embellishments. Gorgeous. And it works so well because it's really a thin, thin lace. And it's almost a little scratchy. It's not like um, a soft lace, but it just works so well when I'm applying it to different pieces with the Mod Podge or whatever decoupage medium you have. Well, probably glue. I haven't tried that, but it's pretty much like a glue anyway. So, yeah. Anyway, I covered the entire hanger, you can see here, with that beautiful, beautiful lace. And I tried to make it as seamless as possible so you can see where I had to start and finish some of the laces because, or some of the pieces of the lace. But anyway, that's what gave the base of the hanger. And this beautiful trim that I just got from uh, Rose, well, recently got from Rosanna Lopez, Creative Zoe here on uh, YouTube. She um, was selling a lace and trims kit, and it was such a great deal and beautiful stuff. And look at the movement, and oh, I just love it. I love the lace, and I almost used the whole thing because it's just. I, I had put it on one side and then I just can't, I don't know, I just don't like when things aren't finished, so I put it on the back as well. And you see where I took this trim from Artie's store. She is one little dreamer and she had this, she has beautiful bridal trims. And the trim that I used is this trim right here. And I cut it, I cut it in pieces to kind of give it that little arch and cover that area there. And I did that on both sides. And then on, on this side, I added this beautiful rhinestone piece, which the silly uh, pearl came out of. So I need to fix that, my bad. I tried to, but I think the glue didn't dry yet. <laughs> And then I added, if you can see up close, little teeny 
Brilliance rhinestones that I got at Hobby Lobby, They're the really sparkly ones, because I really wanted to do a quality, you know, I wanted to use really good quality materials on this because this is going to hold my best friend, well, my dear friend Donna's um, daughter-in-law's wedding dress because her son is getting married here this weekend. So that is the beautiful hanger that I made for her wedding dress. And I hope that she really loves it. And she's doing a vintage themed wedding. So very shabby. Actually, it's not, I don't, well, I consider like these colors shabby, kind of a little bit brighter. And she's doing very, very pale peaches and creams and tan very light tans and everything so it's more of a vintagey wedding um, theme and so this will look beautiful holding her dress I just can't wait to see it well anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this and um, I hope you are having an awesome week and I will talk to you real soon let me know what you think about this all right guys talk to you soon bye bye